mysterious weightlifting fairy became very popular in primetime television. Because your young viewers were able to relate to the triumphs and struggles of your character, whatever she had to go through. So how did you prepare for your role as Kim Bok Joon? 어, 필리핀에서 복주를 굉장히 많이 사랑해 주셨다고 얘기를 들었어요. 너무 감사해요. She has heard from uh, that the Philippine fans really love the Kim Bok Joon series, so thank you very much. 복주는 <웃음> 외형으로도 이제 뭐 살도 찌워야 되고 역도도 해야 되지만 실제로 그 최대생의 모습을 잘 담기 위해서 진짜 복주의 마음을 이해하고 복주의 생활을 따라가려고 So she had a hard time physically as well to look uh, to, to, to look a bit chubbier and to physically look like Kim Bok Joo. But to uh, to fill into the, to be a character of Kim Bok Joo, she tried herself so well to understand the personality and characteristics, even small steps of Kim Bok Joo. Even though she had to get chubbier, she was still so pretty, right? So pretty. Speaking of Kim Bok Joo. You popularized, you and your friends popularized swag. Swag. <laughs> <laughs> so, speaking of swag, what situations do you consider swag for you? Right now. <laughs> Alright, question number five. Can fans of Weightlifting Fairy expect a second season? She has to discuss with the director and the writer of Kim Bok Joon. 